Hello and welcome everybody, welcome to another episode. Today, well I'm Lurik, but and today <laughs> with line adding uh, Spockter, Spatic the lizard boy himself, uh, because yeah, I've been kind of been over that in the sketch video that we did like two days ago on this channel, um, that I've been wanting to do some more fan art again. Well, I mean, really, I've been realistically doing fan art pretty regularly on this channel, but I don't mean like uh, of ga other games and stuff. Because, uh, yeah, I did like some game fan art, I guess, of like popular culture, furries, whatever. But I also mean like from YouTubers, and I think the last one was actually Ice Colo in the beginning of the year. I'm not exactly sure. Uh, so I've been wanting to do a new, uh, another one and yeah, I landed on this one because why the heck not? Uh, whenever I did watch his videos, he was pretty, uh, yeah, relatable, it's pretty on point or like I can agree with a lot of the stuff. So, uh, yeah, why not? Uh, and I think that really his two lizard characters are pretty cool. Though I would say that I do prefer this one, the Neo one, the, the tech boy, the blue dude, the blue Liz, hell yeah. <laughs> Very nice. Uh, one thing I often like kind of have in the back of my head whenever I do these kind of fan art videos is like, what if they actually see the video? It's like if you make it of a fan of like a video game character the character doesn't exist, you can like, maybe the devs or like the whatever can like see the video, but it's like, you don't really care about that, you, it's like, there's no worries at all. If you like make a fan out of like an actual kind of like person, a YouTuber, someone like that, it's like, there's a higher chance that they like see what you're doing and that they might even like react to it, like in some way of like a comment or whatever. Which happened to them with Ice Pillow, which was very nice, that was very ooh, very made me happy. Uh, but still, like sometimes you have like things when you're like, I don't know, I don't like often watch like, uh, like on YouTube I often watch like a lot of like whatever is recommended to me and music really which like both shifts a lot i don't like often subscribe and radically watch people so everybody i like been drawing or fan out of i do really like these people but like uh, i don't watch like every video of like Spockter or ice color or majira or, like all these people i've been drawn uh but still i really do like them so often in these videos i'm like what if i uh, say something or something that's not accurate or like say something like that that I don't watch every video and then maybe they see it <laughs> I mean it really doesn't matter I mean I don't really need a justification to draw a fan of something it is just a nice gesture we're on its own but yeah I don't know it's just a, a thing because I also make it a video you know but <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. In general, I've been also, not just with this, but in general, I'm often like a person that worries a lot and I'm really trying to not do that. Not to do that action, because <laughs> that seems like a like not good thing to do usually. Like, I don't know. Worrying never like does anything. It doesn't get you anywhere really ever, unless you actually do protective measures or something. So, which is like not really worrying right if you have like a worry a fear or something either you do something or just not worry right being like in the middle it's like nah and that's kind of what i've been trying and like also kind of with the same thing of being like scared of or ashamed of things and stuff like that it's like i mean yeah i'm just trying to like stand over that basically you know i don't I, I'm trying to just do my things and do them and not worry about all this kind of stuff. It is not easy, but I mean, probably a lot of people like relate to me here, but yeah, just trying to like improve as a person here and there, you know, and like really get more out of my shell whenever I can. But yeah, 
<laughs> not always easy, but yeah, just doing my best. And yeah, also on the art, obviously doing my best. Hell yeah, transition. Um, <laughs> the line art, I'm really liking it. I don't know, something about it, the torso kind of being like this diagonal and then like kind of like I decide to like um, line off or like cut it at the bottom. As you can see, I always like these kind of like oh, kind of diagonal cuts at the bottom where it just cuts off. Uh, yeah, I like this. And yeah, I, I don't know. I feel like the jacket, I really nailed it with the line arts even, even better. Freaking hell yeah. The hat is pretty nice as well. Like the only thing, like the arm on the left, I'm not too, too sure, but I feel like this, like the final result of it, pretty okay. I'm fine with it. So hell yeah, I like this. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this awesome video. And yeah, see y'all in the next one.